all right so welcome to the tutorial of liquid glass effect we are going to learn how to create this liquid effect this liquid effect and more contrast liquid effect like this with just one click and the tool that we are going to use is motif and along with this basic tutorial if you want a little further reading and documentation then you can actually access this file i'll provide the link in the description you can pretty much just sign up here give your detail you don't have to pay anything just click here and get the link in your gmail all right now let's look at how do you create these effects with one click so it's pretty simple just create a rectangle give it white color give it 30 percent opacity give it corner radius go to effect and then select liquid glass you can already see that the liquid glass effect is applied a bit here but we're going to change the range range basically means in what area the bending of light is going to happen lensing is how much of bending is going to happen so if i increase bending to 50 and range to something like 30 and you can see that there is this liquid glass effect if i increase this it will look more like a water droplet if i make it a capsule it's going to look something like this now if i look at this you can see that there is a highlight and there is also a tint in order to achieve that what you can do is you can change the color from this to something like this you now get the red tint now add a stroke give it a gradient so we'll just play with the opacity here a bit 30 40 0 is fine 30 and then maybe increase decrease and let's see how that works cool looks fine now you can see that this one has more contrast right and if you want more contrast like this then you can basically go here click on effects again instead of drop shadows go to background blur and then increase the blur amount instead of it being red in color you can make it black in color and then increase the blackness a bit this color can actually become white i usually prefer white color highlights i don't like the tint one but of course depends on context right so this can be reduced a bit all right so this looks neat now if you look at this one you can see that subscribe is written on top of it and it is creating a very interesting effect based on the background how do you create that so let's write subscribe by the way if you are liking the tutorial please give it a like to the video and also please subscribe to the channel that gives me motivation knowing that whatever i'm doing is getting noticed by people is getting appreciated by people so we created this subscribe text now what we can do is just go to layer and select overlay and let's just select both of them align them i think it just needs to be slightly Control g and they are now grouped so this is interesting right so that's all for this tutorial please do subscribe do like the video and i'll see you in the next one bye bye